please click on the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get the latest notifications hello everyone it's me JV from unique tutorials today in this video we'll compare the Bing charts and the Google Lens that is which will perform better and which can give us the better results so without any further more delay let's begin first of all you need to download two applications that is the first application is named as Bing that is from the Microsoft itself so you first download this application so the second app you need to download is Google Lens as you can see the Google Lens as you can see the applications here Google Lens so you need to download these two applications Google Lens so we'll compare the sport applications side by side and what they can provide us so the first we'll try and to find some image pictures informations by using the Google Lens so here it comes so I'll try to capture this picture and we'll try to find out some informations whether we get or not as you can see here so I'm clicking this so it displaying the informations here so not that accurate so still we'll try one more So it's giving the color but not exactly the given pictures. As we all know that Google Lens is very useful while you are searching for any items or what re it really calls and uh, what it is being named. So it's not a far fact in my sense so we'll try with Bing. So as you can see a Bing so here you can see a lens this is called the Bing lens or the Bing images this application is developed by Microsoft so we'll try to see whether Bing lens or the Bing images works better than Google lens the interference is almost the same so we'll try to capture this picture and we'll see how much information this being can provide us or not so we'll wait for a few seconds so that it finds out what it really it is so whether Bing works better than Google Lens or not so it's saying it's an origami yes definitely it's like right it is an origami but I don't think so that's providing the same exact features what the structure is called maybe the lenses are finding difficult to recognize it directly so I'm not getting any similar pictures below as you can see so I think in my opinion there is no final winner in finding informations regarding some information of all things so in my opinion neither the Google Lens or the Microsoft Bing Lens or the Microsoft Imagers is perfect still they need a lot of improvements in my opinion so you try and check it out by yourself and leave your comments below in the video so that I can discuss 
what improvements they really need in both the Google Lens and Microsoft Lens or the Microsoft Imagers. I hope you find this information useful and please do support our channel by subscribing our channel and lastly thanks for watching.